guys, my name is Hannah, welcome back to my YouTube channel and welcome to day 18 of our advert calendar workouts. So today we're going to be doing leg stretches. So a couple of days ago we did back stretches, so today we're going to be stretching our legs and working on our leg flexibility. And if you are a person that is trying to get their splits or trying to improve their splits and maybe do a hyperextended splits or like a split development of some description, <laughs> um, then this is really, really gonna help you. So keep watching, come and join me, or you can just improve your hamstring flexibility through this workout as well, which is always good, especially as you get a little bit older. So before we start, really important that you do a massive warm up, especially with your legs. So do a couple of jogs on the spot, couple of jumps up and down, star jumps, scissor legs, high knees, bum kicks, anything that you can get your legs moving um, in your warm up, please do so before you start because I don't wanna risk pulling a muscle because we're gonna stretch it and we're gonna do quite deep stretches. So please ensure you have warmed up before we start. And once you have done that, come back and join us and we're gonna get started. So like the last stretch video, I'm just gonna show you what we're doing and we're gonna do them together. So. First move, we are going to sit with our legs in front, toes pointed away from you, and back up as straight as you can get it. You're then going to take your arms up above your head, as tall as you can, so you're sitting up as much as you can, and we're gonna slowly fold forward and get our nose then towards our knees. Now, if you just reach there and hold that position, you won't be able to go um, as far as you can. You can feel it in the backs of your legs and it'll be quite painful, but I'm gonna teach you a little trick to get a little bit further. So, backs up as straight as you can. Pushing your knees down, toes pointed in front of you. So everybody join in with me. We're gonna put our arms up above our head, nice and straight, and you're gonna extend that back as much as you can. Then we're gonna slowly fold forward, keeping our knees pushed down into the floor. And once you can feel the pull on the backs of your legs, so I can feel the pull here, I'm gonna push my shoulder blades forward, like I'm gonna give somebody a present, like I'm chucking something at somebody. So I'm going down and then I'm gonna push through my shoulder blades and get lower and try and get my nose down to my knee. So let's do that together. So back up straight, pushing your knees down, arms up as tall as you can. So really reach through those arms and through the back and slowly fold forward. Once you can feel it pulling on the backs of your hamstrings, that's when you're gonna push down and get your nerves down. And we're gonna hold this position here. So just get as low as you can go and keep sinking further into your legs. That's it, hold it there. seconds. A little bit longer and sit up. Well done. Perfect. Okay. Second one. We're going to sit in straddle. So we're going to take our legs nice and wide apart. So get your legs as wide as you can and push those knees down, toes pointed away from you. So you're keeping your back up nice and straight, arms go in the air, and we're gonna turn our body, so we're gonna twist and face one leg. You're gonna keep that knee where it is, so try not to let it roll in, keep it pushed back, and we're gonna fold down onto one knee and hold it there. So just get your nose down as low as you can go, hold this position, Keep pushing that knee down as much as you can. Couple more seconds. And sit up. Well done. We're going to do the same on the other leg. So twisting up to your hips, facing that leg, and folding down. Get your nose down towards your knee. And make sure those both those knees stay straight. So no bends in your knees. Excellent. 
of there and sit up. Okay, next stretch is a single leg fold in your straddle. So you're gonna take one leg, any leg, and you're gonna fold it in and keep the other leg where it is, nice and straight. We're gonna do the same thing. So we, instead of facing our leg, we're gonna go up and over. So you're gonna take one hand over your ribs, other hand in the air, we're gonna go up and over towards our foot. You're gonna try and get your ear to touch your knee. So hold this position. And if you can, you can get your elbow, your shoulder flat, elbow and shoulder flat on the floor and hold it there. Excellent, and reach up. We're gonna do the other leg. So taking one leg in, other leg away from you and pointed. We're gonna take one hand across our ribs and we're gonna go up and over to the side. So try and get your ear down to the floor. Well done. Okay, next stretch. We're going onto our back. So on your back, with both knees bent, you're going to take one leg up to the ceiling and you're going to hold it there. So you're going to bring it towards your chest without touching it with your hands and you're just going to hold it there. So pull it back as much as you can. So your knees going towards your chest. Excellent, and swap legs, so other leg, push it towards your face, make sure that your knees stay straight, so no bend in your knee, push that knee back. Couple more seconds. Excellent, right, we're gonna take the first leg again, up into the air, now you're going to take your hands at the back of your calf and you're going to pull it towards your face really gently for a couple of seconds. So hold it there. Okay, and let go with your hands but leave your leg there and keep pushing that knee nice and straight. So keep holding. Excellent, and swap legs. So other leg in the air, take your fingertips at the back of your calf, giving it a nice gentle pull. Make sure your knees remain straight when you're pulling it back towards your face. Hold it there. And let go with your hands, keep your leg there. Keep pushing that knee nice and straight. Excellent, well done. Right, last few stretches now. We're going to face sideways and we're going to do a hip lunge forward. So we're going to take one leg in front, toes going forward. We're going to drive our hips into that leg. So we're going to push them forward. So we're creating a smaller gap between our hamstring and our calf. So we're going to hold it there. Make sure that that back leg isn't kicking in towards your bum. It's nice and straight because that is what's going to keep your hip in line. And if you can, take your both arms above your head because that's going to increase the stretch a little bit further into your hip. Okay, hold it here. Really drive those hips forwards. Excellent. And straighten that knee. Get your nose down. Hold it there. Excellent, right, we're gonna do the other leg there. So one leg in front, driving those hips forward, 
Same again, make sure that that back leg is nice and straight and the toes aren't kicking in towards your bum. And you can take your arms up above your head to increase that stretch further. Couple more seconds. And straighten that front leg, get your nose down to your knee and hold it there. and do the splits. Now we've done a lot of stretches so if you can't do the splits don't worry you can put cushions or pillows underneath you and that's going to help you to sink down a little bit further but we're just going to give it a go because it's going to stretch our hamstrings either way. So we're going to take the first leg that we stretched in front, we're going to slide it down, make sure that that back leg isn't kicking in towards your bum, take your hands down Slide that front leg and hold it there. So if you are flat down to the floor, you're then going to walk your fingertips backwards, stick your chest out and hold it there. That's just going to help you get a little bit flatter. And you also want to make sure that you're not twisted. So you want to make sure that both your hips are in line. So you've got nice straight legs and not facing sideways. You want to be facing your front leg. Hold it there. Excellent. And give your legs a little bit of a shake. And we're going to do the other leg. So lunging up. One leg in front. Make sure that back leg is nice and straight. We're going to slide that front leg. Hands down. Slide yourself down as far as you can go. And same again if you're flat. Then take your hands back. Stick that chest out. Present it. And point toes, <laughs> make it look nice. Excellent. And give your legs a shake. Well done. So that is day 17. I hope you enjoyed it. Something a little bit different. It's something you can always refer back to. You can do these all of the time, every morning, every night, if you really want to improve your leg flexibility. So I hope you enjoyed it. And if you did, give it a thumbs up. And I will see you again tomorrow for day number 18. Bye guys.